So I wanted to test the 1050 Ti in Warzone Pacific to see if we could get some decent performance that is playable and enjoyable. And these Kill settings here targets. was Go. the settings that the game automatically Enemy set it to. Nearby. And I guess they maybe target around 60 FPS or so uh, from their own testing. It set the resolution scaling to 66, so I'm basically rendering the game at 720p, even though it's uh, displayed as 1080p on my monitor. And it didn't set all of the settings down to the lowest, uh, so the game isn't looking too bad when it comes to the graphics. So it's not like I have a good like uh, enjoyment of the graphics, but it's very nice and playable and it doesn't really look all that bad I have to say even though we get a lot of like uh, hard edges and uh, texture, texture on things that is a little bit like smushed out or uh, something like that but we can see that the performance here gets around 70 frames per uh, second average with a 1% low of 50 frames and I have to say that is very ground. acceptable Moving. and you can really play at these settings and I found it to be very smooth and nice and it wasn't like all jittery and such so uh, I would be fine playing and um, not competitive but actually playing around them uh, try to do my best and not having issues with this so I also just wanted to test if we could render at 1080p and here all of the settings was set down to the lowest possible and we can see we were just getting around 40 fps so I just skipped this and went back to the rendering scaling to 66 and now I've set all of the settings down to the lowest uh, so a little bit worse textures and such we can see the stones here looks a little bit worse and the anti-aliasing is completely off so <clears throat> it maybe runs a little bit smoother with a little bit higher frame rates but it looks a little bit worse and uh, I can still enjoy the game and uh, get decent performance and also not play too bad compared to the other, sp other players here but when looking at the distance at players it's like hard to tell if it's a bush or if it's actually a person but then we more had to actually look for like moving objects to uh, see the difference there but when it comes to the overall performance there's no issues at all uh, playing with the 1050 ti in my opinion so just so with these kind of lower frame rates you don't really need to have that good of a processor to match it with either but uh, at least you want something that isn't gonna bottleneck your 1050 ti so I think this concludes this benchmarking here. We can see that we got 73 frames average with a 1% low of 51 on my like benchmarking run and that is very acceptable and smooth and we don't really get any frame dips which is nice. So you can like play a little bit competitive without any issues in my opinion. So I just wanted to play out this round here to see how it would go. I guess since I've done like a lot of benchmark runs dying fairly early and also and also just leaving the game they have put me not with the best of enemies I guess at least or I'm just a very good player <laughs> but I guess not but looking here it was like hard to tell is it a bush or is there a player behind there and I think that was uh, a common thing that I got back to like at distances I was not really sure if there was a player there or a bush but I guess if the player is not moving uh, it tended to be like some kind of plant but overall here uh, I haven't really played a lot to like get the 
strategies of how to move around on this map is uh, very very in terrain and I have to say in these kind of environments everything looks fairly similar but there's a lot of places you can hide and jump down and such which is fairly nice so in, even if you get shot at there's often a way to like move away from your enemy and then hit back at them as we can see here maybe the enemies I uh, met wasn't the best because they were starting to shoot at me and uh, I could shoot back at them without dying so yeah so I played Vanguard and I've seen a lot of players complain about the snipers at least in the multiplayer but the, the one I tried here actually worked fairly well and I have one Vanguard class level up and don't really you remember the, the name of these guns uh, but I really like this gun here, but I was outmatched here when you this guy just popped out right in front of me. I know, I knew that he was somewhere you around there, and I thought he was Nearly standing there. still. But there were the house there, but that was a bush, you and he just 20. jumped out in my sight, and I died. But overall, a good run, I guess. So, thank you for watching.